Hello again, educators. I am Elsie Kanoy, and welcome to my video. For today's video, let's talk about physical education in America. The driver behind the establishment of the physical education system in America was war. In short, the fitness of soldier in combat became a country-wide priority. After the end of American Civil War, school system implemented physical education programs and enacted laws that would make the inclusion of physical education programs compulsory in all public schools. After World War I ended, the stressing overall health statistic revealed that one third of all drafted recruits in the U.S. military were not physically fit for the combat. The government intended and passed legislation intended to advance the quality of physical education classes throughout the country. During World War II, physical education programs become more common for men and women due to the physical fitness that was required in military service and for manual labor jobs. As a response to an inquiry that concluded that the men rejected from American military jobs during World War II were unfit for service due to childhood malnourishment, the Roosevelt administration introduced the National School Lunch Program intended to improve the nutrition of American school children. In 1975, the United States House of Representatives amended the, the Federal Education Act in order to lift gender, gender discrimination in school physical education programs. This granted girls and women new opportunities to participate and complete the athletic in high school and college. Currently, according to the United States President Council on Fitness, Sports and Nutrition, 95% of high school and 84% of middle schools require physical education. However, only 69% of elementary school do so. 38 of 50 states no require or encourage district and schools to follow physical education standards based on the national standard for physical education. The success key factor on any physical education program is ensuring that any decade time is devoted to physical education. Currently, recommendations are at least 150 minutes per week for elementary school and 225 minutes per week for middle and high schools. 